The news of a love at one's death hits every person differently. The aftermath of that news, then, takes unique forms the world over as cultures celebrate the life and honor the death of individuals in ways often singular to their culture. Let's look at 7 distinct burial rituals. And don't forget to subscribe to our channel and turn on the notification bell so that you will be notified each time we upload an amazing video. On top of our list is the Sky Burial. Sky burial is common in Tibet among Buddhists who believe in the value of sending their loved one's souls toward heaven. In this ritual, bodies are left outside, often cut into pieces, for birds or other animals to devour. This serves the dual purpose of eliminating the now empty vessel of the body and allowing the soul to depart, while also embracing the circle of life and giving sustenance to animals. What a ritual! Second on our list is Feminiana. Dancing with the Dead Best describes the burial tradition in Madagascar of Famadihana. The Malagasy people open the tombs of their dead every few years and wrap them in fresh burial clothes. Each time the dead get fresh wrappings, they also get a fresh dance near the tomb while music plays all around. This ritual translated as the turning of the bones it's meant to speed up decomposition and push the spirit of the dead toward the afterlife. Water Burial Many cultures, especially in Nordic countries, have embraced water in the rituals of joys for the dead. From laying coffins atop cliff face toward the water to actually using the water as a burial ground, some set bodies adrift in death ships, either along a river or sent out into the ocean, giving the bodies back to the gods or places most valued by the people of the area. The parade, celebrating the life of the deceased can take many forms. A tradition from Varanasi, India, involves parading the dead through the streets. The bodies dressed in colors that highlight the virtues of the deceased, red for purity or yellow for knowledge. For example, in an effort to encourage souls to reach salvation, ending the cycle of reincarnation, the bodies are sprinkled with water from the Ganges River and then cremated at the town's main cremation grounds. Tower of Silence, one Zoroastrian tradition requires vultures to keep its ancient burial ritual alive. In that tradition, a dead body is believed to defile everything it touches including the ground and fire and raising a corpse to the sky for vultures to devour was historically the only option. Bull's urine is used to clean the body before tools, which are later destroyed, are used to cut off clothing. The corpse is then placed atop a Tower of Silence, out of the way of the living who could be tainted by it. Ashes to death beats, while countless burial traditions around the world include cremation, South Koreans have taken it a step further by turning the ashes of the deceased into beads. These beads have a bit of a shine to them and come in an array of colors, from pink or black to turquoise. Placed inside glass vases or even open in dishes, the beads can then take center stage inside a home, a more decorative choice than a conventional urn. In a country where space is at premium and cremation is becoming the only realistic choice for burying the dead, Getting something beautiful out of the process gives loved ones a new tradition to embrace and an heirloom to treasure. What a nice way to be remembered. Last but not least, before we get to the last ritual, have you subscribed to our channel? If not, kindly hit the subscribe button and turn on the notification bell. In rate of Filipino traditions, we promise seven unique burial rituals, but when it comes to the Philippines, there were just too many to choose from. The Tinguian people dress the deceased in the fanciest of clothes and sit the body on a chair, often placing a lit cigarette in the lips, while the bank people blindfold their dead before placing them in chairs at the entrance of the home. The Cebuano people dress children attending funerals in red to lessen the chance that they will see ghosts. The Sagana region features coffins hung from cliffs, bringing the souls of the dead closer to heaven, while people in Cavite often entomb the deceased vertically in a hollowed-out tree chosen by the person before death. The diversity of regions in the Philippines has given rise to a diversity of Filipino burial rituals that come second to none. We come to the end of our video. Thanks for watching. Goodbye.